In this Max Tow Gauges installation video, we'll show you how to install a Max Tow Match Diesel Gauge Package, including a 60 PSI boost, exhaust gas temperature, and transmission temperature gauge to your 2010 to 2018 Ram 2500 and 3500 fourth gen Cummins. For the purpose of this installation, we will be using a 2017 Ram 2500 with a 6.7 liter Cummins engine to install our gauges. The gauges will be installed to a factory fitted 4th gen Cummins pillar pod. We will also use a boost bolt adapter, 1 8 NPT drill and tap set, transmission T fitting adapter and expandable circuits for installation. All of these accessories can be found at maxtow.com. For safety, disconnect the negative battery terminals before starting any work on the vehicle. To install the boost sensor, start by removing the engine cover using an 8mm socket. Locate and remove the front inner intake heater grid bolt using a 10 mm socket with an extension. Install the boost bolt using a 17 mm wrench. Install the boost sensor using a 22 mm wrench. Plug the sensor harness into the boost sensor and route to the driver's side of the engine bay firewall using zip ties to secure the harness. Ensure there is no contact with any direct heat source or moving parts of the truck. Reinstall the engine cover using an eight millimeter socket. Run the sensor harness through the engine bay of the truck and through the firewall using a grommet. To install the exhaust gas temperature probe, start by using a pick and a Phillips head screwdriver to remove the airbox lid and coupler. Locate the exhaust manifold on the passenger side of the engine bay and mark the location where you are going to drill a hole using a center punch right above the turbo mount. Keep in mind that there is a divider in the middle, so you will need to drill on either side of the divider to ensure the hole is unobstructed. Starting with a 1 8 inch drill bit, drill a pilot hole into the exhaust manifold. Continue increasing the size of the pilot hole using various drill bits until you reach the drill bit size R. Ensure all shavings are out of the manifold by periodically using a pin magnet and a vacuum to remove them. Using cutting oil, tap the hole to 1 8 27 NPT. Apply anti-seize to the threads of the EGT ferrule fitting and thread the fitting into the exhaust manifold. Tighten the fitting with a 14 mm wrench. Install the gauge's EGT probe into the ferrule fitting adapter, ensuring the sensor is positioned approximately halfway into the manifold. Tighten using a 14 mm wrench. Route the EGT probe harness up to the firewall and use zip ties to secure the probe wire.
Reinstall the airbox lid and coupler using a Phillips head screwdriver. Plug in the EGT probe harness extension to the EGT probe. Route the EGT probe harness through the firewall using a grommet. To install the transmission temperature sensor, start by safely raising the truck. Have a drain pan available for any fluid that leaks. Using a marker, mark the transmission hot side cooler line where the T-fitting will fit after it is installed. Using a 20 mm and 24 mm wrench, loosen the transmission hot side cooler line. Using a pick tool, remove the retaining clip holding the line into the transmission and then remove the trans cooler line. Use the T-fitting to measure and mark the location in the line that needs to be removed. This portion should be 1 7 8 inches long. Using a pipe cutter, cut the line at the marks and deburr the cut ends. Insert the nut and cutting ring onto the line. Hold the body of the T-fitting with a wrench and hand tighten each compression nut. Apply Teflon tape to the threads of the temperature sensor and thread the sensor into the port on the T-fitting housing. Tighten it with a 14 millimeter wrench. Reinstall the transmission cooler line into the transmission. Don't forget to reinstall the retaining clip to the side of the line that goes into the transmission. Hold the body of the T-fitting and tighten the nut one quarter more turn with a 7 8 inch and 22 millimeter wrench to ensure proper sealing of the cutting rings.
Plug the transmission temperature sensor harness into the temperature sensor. Route the transmission temperature sensor harness up to the firewall to the driver's side of the engine bay and use zip ties to secure the sensor wires. Ensure there is no contact with any direct heat source or moving parts. Run the sensor harness through the firewall using a grommet. Remove the factory A-pillar using an 8mm socket. Move the weather strip out of the way and remove the side trim panel of the dash. Install the full replacement 3-gauge A-pillar pod using the supplied mounting bolt and a 4mm Allen key. Route the 3-gauge power harness through the gauge pod down through the dash and through the grommet into the engine bay. Route the sensor harness through the dash and into the gauge locations on the gauge pod. We have boost at the top, EGT in the middle, and trans temp at the bottom. Reinstall the side panel for the dash. Reinstall the weather stripping. Plug the power harness and sensor harness into the back of each designated gauge and slide the gauges into the gauge pod. Reconnect the negative terminals of the two batteries and prepare power for the gauge. Pull the power harness through the firewall to the fuse box location under the hood. Locate fuse number F84 in the fuse panel for constant 12 volt power. Locate fuse number F93 in the fuse panel for ignition only 12 volt power. Locate fuse number F79 in the fuse panel for headlight only 12 volt power. Using an expandable circuit, crimp it to the yellow wire. Insert the fuse into the circuit and insert the circuit into the empty fuse number F84 slot. Using a second expandable circuit, Crimp it to the red wire Insert the fuse into the circuit and insert the circuit into the empty fuse number F93 slot. Using a third expandable circuit, crimp it to the orange wire Insert the fuse into the circuit and insert the circuit into the empty fuse number F79 slot. 
Using an eyelet connector, secure the black wire from the gauge to the grounding bolt next to the fuse box using a 10 millimeter socket. You've now successfully installed your Max Toe Match 3 gauge diesel set into your 2010 to 2018 Ram 4th Gen Cummins diesel truck. If you have any questions, concerns, or comments, please contact us at 1-877-7-MAX-TOW, and we'll see you on the road.